Good morning, Gaffer. Good morning. Good morning. We've got a new captain. Yeah, yeah Sam Togwell uh, with uh, Joe uh, choosing to uh, go to Bristol Rovers. Uh, Sam uh, brings a wealth of experience, um, very well respected, very good work ethic. Um, he's a champion at this level, he knows what's needed. And um, he's had a hernia operation before he came here, so which is probably brought him here not at full speed, probably not at top level that he needed to be, which we knew that. So it's taken a couple of games for him to get up to full speed, but he was excellent against Forest Green. He's very well respected in the dressing room, and uh, he'll be a very good uh, captain um, for the rest of the season. And obviously it's been a busy transfer market for Eastley, but Scott Wilson has decided to stay, which can only be a positive. Yeah, we had a, an offer come in, I think it was yesterday, for Scott. Um, he turned it down, he didn't want to go, and I'm, I'm certainly not going to force anybody out. I'm not in that, in that mould where they've got to train with a youth team or get treated badly to train in the afternoon. Uh, I like Scott, he's a really good lad, I really like him as a person. And um, uh, we'll, and we'll see how things uh, change, but obviously being mid-table, then uh, things have got to change here, yeah, you know, I don't think anyone can deny that. And not this morning it was coming that three coach loads of fans will be travelling to Sutton. What can they expect from Saturday's game? Well, I think the people that went over to uh, the supporters that took up to went up to uh, Borehamwood. Um, I don't think it was a spectacular game, but it was certainly a, an effective, efficient performance. So we've certainly been making some progress. For this one, we've just seen them beat Wimbledon and also uh, draw away at Wimbledon. They've got some very good players, They're very well organised. The manager's a good manager with lots of success. The league that they won last year against some big spending clubs. They're very effective, very efficient, and do a good job. And um, it's going to be a tough game. But as we know, if, uh, if our players are right on their game, as we were against Forest Green, which I thought was a very good performance, we could have won that game. Perhaps near the end we could have lost it, of course. But uh, there's room for improvement, and uh, as I said, it's, uh, it's work in progress here at the moment. Fine, Gaffer. Any other changes ahead of Sutton? The squad? Uh, changes to the squad. Uh, we've just signed a young lad, a uh, little winger called uh, Mackay. Only till the end of the season, really on a bit of a trial basis, really, I guess, till the end of the season. He's quick, plays on the left wing, can play up front or he can cut in on the, on the right hand side. He's a very quick young boy. So we're going to give him a little try because I think we need a little bit of pace uh, in our team and a bit more quality. I was trying to get together a bit of a few fighters, if you like, or competitors. So we do add, need to add a little bit of quality, and hopefully he's going to bring that. Um, young Bear Wish has scored a hat trick yesterday, so we're going to have him training now up with the first team. Lee Peacock's given him uh, rave reviews over the last few weeks. He's only 17, um, so he's stepping up now, and I'm going to have him with the first team probably through to the end of the season and uh, see if we can train him and develop him and work him and get him up to the level uh, ready for next August and maybe for a game or two towards the end of this season. And then uh, another young boy who I like uh, called Fee. Um, he's, he's, his name's Fee. Uh, so he's going to be training with us now because he's been doing very well as well with Peaks. So uh, I want to get a good look at them and see if we've got some boys to, to come through for the future. Brilliant. Thank you very much.